Hello everyone, Chris at Dentless Touch. Today we're gonna to go over my five favorite tools for 2018, so stay tuned. All right guys, before I go over my favorite tools for 2018, be advised that these tools either came out in 2018 or I received them and started using this using the tools every day in 2018 so let's get started so the first up and it's not in any particular order guys but the first one we have is the gangrene tabs from black plague the square ones these give enormous amount of pull compared to the round ones it will benefit you tremendously to go ahead and pick up a set of these square uh, glue tabs to continue with the green theme, guys, is the Stucky uh, Wedge tool that he came up with, uh, I think about a year or two ago, and we started implementing these uh, wedges in our um, daily routine. Compared to these little cheap red ones, what make this unique, guys, is that this one has two raised areas, which allows it to uh, kind of be more stationary in the door and not come out, and then you have to pick it up off the floor or inside the car, and you just spend more time trying to work with wedges than anything else so definitely a step up it's only like 15 bucks but definitely get some stucky the stucky wedges as well. all right guys so next up is the stand liner pirate hook i believe uh they came out with this tool about 2017 at least for the market they probably had this design going for 10 years now this tool I use for creases. It's like the crease killer for me, um, especially in fenders and quarter panels. I can't quite get this down a door. You can if, you know, I take a lot of doors apart so I can kind of get it in there. But I, I go to this tool if, if it's a crease or any type of dent, uh, just because of the unique leverage that you can, that it provides when you're doing the, um, when you're trying to remove a dent out. So, I right, so for the one tool that I literally was amazed at is the Get a Grip. Uh, they call it the strong arm. This is the XL. You're more than welcome to get the other version. I think it does, you know, just as good. Um, sometimes I don't even need the the uh, one extra arm. Uh, but this tool is what I use to hold my heat gun uh, right here. This is my propane heat gun, or uh, a regular corded heat gun, or even my uh, DJI uh, Osmos um, uh, pocket. So it's a very universal tool. Uh, you pretty much just hold anything. I've actually had to hold my cell phone at one point uh, when I was uh, recording a live stream. So got to have one of these. It is the strong arm from Get A Grip now, guys. So last but not least, it's the James Lee light. And I got to give credit where credit is due. This light has changed the game for a lot of techs. There is no pumping mechanism. It's all automatic. And that's what makes this light so beautiful and so unique. Uh, the Also, the changes in the board that you can do, use. And I think I actually didn't know how to use this and why this matters. But when you change the distance between the LEDs, this adds a difference in grade effects. How sharp the actual uh, light is onto the uh, dent. So for sharper dents, I tend to push the lens a little closer to the LEDs and to get that perfect gradient effect for the finishing, I push it a little bit further away and obviously push the light back. But that's that's some of the qualities of this light. It's, it's game changer and this is one of the reasons why I love buying tools from actual technicians. Hopefully this has been an informative video. If you haven't already, go ahead and subscribe to the channel and if you can, list your five favorite tools for 2018 in the comment section. All right, guys, happy holidays, and I'll see you on the next video. Peace.